gentlemen and everyone in between, welcome back to my channel. Um, today we are checking out the new Bloodless collection. Ah, I know you guys already seen it a billion times, but it's my turn to see it up close and personal and it's not even my collection. So we just gotta give Shaz a big a thank you for letting us borrow her collection and doing a little unboxing with it. But before we get to the nitty gritty, it's time to get pretty! Okay, so I got the base down. We have a foundation, concealer, what is it called? Contour and um, blush, but we didn't do a high oh, and brows, but we didn't do a highlights or anything because I know that it's probably going to be in this box. 
But I know Shaz, I know it's gonna be in here. So, so she's got this wonderful box. It does not look like a normal Jeffree Star box, but that's because it's from Beautylish. However, as soon as I open it up, are those Jeffree's fucking tattoos? Or am I going crazy? Like, those are definitely Jeffree Star's tattoos, like the ones that are on his body, like on a tissue paper. Um, she's already opened it. She hasn't swatched really, um, so we do have like a clean palette and everything. So we we just get to see my reaction to everything. So right on top is the actual Bloodlust palette. So we'll start with that, um, and then I do get to. She did give me the okay to do like a final look with it. So that's why I just did the base and not anything else. Here it is. Oh my goodness, it is very pretty. Wow, the detail on the box itself, like this isn't even the palette, this is just the box, and we've got a good amount of detail on that, like it looks really nice. And you have the back, you can see the snake wrapped around Jeffrey's like, logo. Okay, so that. Uh, ooh, this is so... Nice. It's like this really nice crush velvet. We've got a little knob down here. All right, so. Oh. You can't see it because this plastic piece is so thick. Oh goodness, this is a pretty, pretty palette. Next thing in the collection is the straws. Man, these are pretty. Uh, I want the pink ones, but now I kind of really need the purple ones. <laughs> um, non Jeffree Star products that Shaz got. I think these are samples. How nice. Thanks, Beautylish. So we got a whole bunch of glasses. Let's get the glass out. Hey, it's a glass party. Okay. So first gloss is Sorcery. We'll start with swatching them. She said she swatched the uh, glasses and that was it. Let me, let me show you if I just start going crazy. Um, so this one's like a pinky tone with like shimmers that look purple. Obviously, because it's a purple collection. That's the word I was trying to say. You know, words are hard sometimes. Here we go. Do this and it's never good for you guys to see. Okay. Uh, let me go all the way across my wrist. Like, crazy you know. Alright. You can't see anything. Um, so it's super shimmery and glossy. It looks really good. Unfortunately, I can't get a good view of it on the camera. Maybe once I'm like done swatching on my arm, I'll do like a close-up on my arm and hopefully that'll help. But that one again was sorcery. Sorcery. The next one is sickening. Alright, so sickening is a beautiful like lavender color. It's got like a bit like a bluish tone to it. Lots of glitter. Lots of glitter. Alright. Uh, watch this across my wrist. Oh, this one's got much darker pigment to it than the pink one. You can actually see it a lot better on my arm. See? I like a lot of it. However, I am more of a pink person, so I would definitely probably wear uh, sorcery a little bit more. But again, that one is thickening. You can see both of them right there. Alright, next gloss 
is Lord Star. Every time I see the name of this, I keep thinking Star Lord. You're getting me, Jeffrey. I see you. I see you, Jeffrey. I should be like this, like he does. Um, anyways, this one's like a dark purple, like almost fuchsia e glittery to it. So there's that one. Oh, did I call it? Oh, yeah, we <laughs> were just a I'm stupid. Alright, so Lord Star. There you go. That's a color. Here she is. Look at that. Mm -hmm. The next block, oh, and again, that was Lord Star. Um, our next one is Wizard's Glass. I like the name. I love the name. Okay, so this one's gonna be kind of like, um, I don't know, y'all. It looks kind of mauve, like a dark mauve color, very glittery. Oh, I should probably show you guys up at the camera too. Did I show you the last one? I did. Okay, anyway, so this is Lord Star. And then this one is Wizard's Glass. So this is Wizard's Glass. Oh, it doesn't look good. It's almost like a nudie now. When I look up like here on the viewfinder, it almost looks almost nude. I don't know. I don't know how to describe this color. You guys can tell me in the comments. <laughs> But it's really pretty. I like it. I would wear it. I would definitely wear this. Last gloss in here is going to be, uh, sorry, Iridescent Throne. I can read. Ooh, I like this one a lot. I feel like this is, would be like wonderful, just like a little shimmer on your lips, a little tap tap, tappity tip tap. And we'll see what we put on your lips when we finish. Ooh, I like it. It's not going to show very well on the camera, but we are going to do our best. There we are. It's that last little shiny bit. So again, that one was iridescent throne. And moving on to clean bitch here. Yeah. Okay. So this is going to be the Valor lip Valor liquid lipstick collection mini. Let's see. This is the collection. We're gonna go ahead. Um, I'll do the swatches continuing down my arm, I guess. But we will start with the first one in the box. Um, on the left. First one on the left. Uh, I forgot what I was looking at. Royal Armor. So this one's gonna be like a pale purple that has a lot of shimmer. Here's that. Did I show you the thingy? I'm not gonna be able to see my arm very long. Okay, the next one is going to be I'm Vulgar. It is very reminiscent to Lord Star. Let's do this. Ooh, okay, so it's like the dark super pigmented version of Lord Star, basically. So it's, it's a Lord Star, star, but in a lipstick. I'm stupid. Don't mind me. You can't see it. Yep, maybe. Yeah, I'm, I'm running out of arm, and I'm sorry. The next one is uh, I'm Royalty. This one's gonna be like a matte purple, it looks like. Anyway, I'm bad at this. I'm being really bad at this today. Okay, the next one is Scorpio. This one's definitely a nude, but it does look like it has like a hint of purple in it. Yeah, it definitely has just a teensy bit of purple to it. Okay, okay. that worked. Okay, the next one is Virginity, which I'm thinking is my favorite in here, just looking down at it, honestly. This is like a baby pink, almost nude, but I am very pale, so I don't know how this looks like on me. Mm -hmm. Our next one is Blow Pony, and this one is like a matte lavender. Ew, she's pretty too. I like those two colors together. <laughs> this 
because they're like my two favorite colors right now. Just saying. Anyway, this next one is Clout. Mm -hmm. um, I don't know how to describe this color very well. Let me see. Like a shimmer purple, but it doesn't look... It's very metallic on. So it's not so shimmery, so like metallic purple. I don't know, man. I'm bad. I'm bad at this. Next one. <laughs> Berries on ice. It looks like a very dark, like, purple red. Ooh. I like her. Very pretty. Let me show you the bottle. I keep forgetting that. Um, these aren't called bottles, and I keep calling them bottles, and I don't know why I keep calling them bottles. Tell me why I keep calling them bottles in the comments. I hate myself. How many more times can I say bottles in one sentence? Hey, thanks. Anyway, um, it looks like we just have one more item in the box, and... If you couldn't guess it, I'm like trying really hard not to get this lipstick everywhere. It's the mirror! Alright, so this thing is probably the prettiest mirror I've seen on his website. Granted, it is um, the only one that has like a crown on it. I'm obsessed with it! Um, this is beautiful. I love it. Hi. How you doing? Okay, I'm gonna hurry and do the close-up of this swatch really quick so I can wash this off my arm. Um, and then I can come back and do a fun little look with the Bloodlust palette. Um, I expected her to have one of the highlighters and she didn't, so maybe one of the shades can be used as a highlighter. We'll see what happens. Okay, so those are all of the glosses. You see them now a lot better. <laughs> Definitely have to do close-ups like this more often. And then since I only put them on part of my arm, now it gets difficult. But there are all our lip, oh, or sorry, Velour Lip, lip God, this is hard. Velour Liquid Lipstick Colors. Beautiful. Okay, I'm gonna go wash the shit off real quick. Okay, my arm's clean again, guys. Um, it took a lot of cleaning and scrubbing and there's still glitter and a little bit of purple. But it's okay. Anyway, let's dig in. Before we get into anything, I'm going to go into Your Majesty right here at the top. I'm going to sweep that all over the eye. Um, now I'm going to dig into Vivid Mood, it's like a little lavender shade here, and I'm going to put that in my cheeks. Now, I'm not blaming the makeup because I actually have an issue with this a lot of the time, but like I started right here and now I can't get this one spot of purple to like blend like the rest of it is. It's really irritating, but I'm not blaming, I'm not blaming the palette because again, like my eye tends to do that a lot with makeup. Like there's a spot that just does not I don't know if anybody else has that issue, but like there's one spot in particularly on my eye that doesn't like to blend well. I just, I don't understand it, but it's a thing. Moving on, <laughs> continuing to try to blend this shit out. a little bit of this deviant. I'm gonna sweep it over the top of that, but like just starting at the inner. Okay. Um, I'm gonna try something I don't normally 
normally do, we're gonna cut pretty. My camera stopped recording, so you're a little bit closer to me now, so that I can just like keep an eye on it a little bit better. Uh, yeah, I got this done. I don't know when it stopped, but like that's all I got done. Um, the next thing I was going to do when I realized that it stopped was um, I'm going to take Beauty Sleep, and I'm going to put that where I put the concealer down for the cut crease. So we're going to do that really quick. So I'm taking a little bit of Pink Magic, which is that like really sparkly fuchsia shade right here. I wet my brush to try to pick it up a little bit better. And we're gonna put this like right on top in the middle. There's the eye look. I'm gonna do some of the bottom really quick. Um, I already got like a little bit of hiking in there, but I think I wanna bring some of the, the I don't know if I'm gonna do this one or that one, because this one's like a dark purple, and I kinda wanna like have a darkness underneath, but I also don't at the same time and have like more of like a bright. Let's try it. <sighs> this one or this like super fluffy brush and I'm gonna bring take the crown into the bottom bring a little shimmer a little bit of lightness at the same time that's all pretty well blended I would say pretty happy with it we're gonna use wet jewel I was actually gonna use Wet Jewel as the highlighter, so let's go ahead and use that as our inner corner highlight. Might as well, right? Yeah. I'm gonna 
to Your Majesty again. That was that like really flat, kind of like grayish, whitish shade. And I'm just going to dust it across the top where my eyebrows are. And there's the eye look. Loving it, loving it. So I'm gonna take my highlighter brush and I'm gonna dip back into Wet Jewel again. Cause Wet Jewel's gonna be a highlight. I, I kinda swept it across my hand to see what would happen with it and it did look like a really good highlight, so here we go. Thanks, Jeffrey. You're making things real easy for us today. What? The person who actually bought this collection doesn't buy the highlight that goes with it. It makes me very sad because I just wanted to use it. It's not that I just like am upset at all. It's just I really wanted to see it up close and touch it and play with it. And just, I just wanted to use it, okay? okay? That's all. That's all I wanted. I'm not trying to be selfish. It's not even my money spent on this. I'm going to do wizard splash. From what I remember, this one looked kind of cool on my arm. I definitely just dropped that. <laughs> but I definitely like this a lot more than um, the different, or the look. Lipsticks. Um, again, like I'm just not a big lipstick person to begin with, uh, but I do my best. I try to like, I try to do these things, and I just can't. Okay, I'm Nemo. I try to do these things, and I just can't, Nemo. That's that is the Bloodless Collection. These are my baby hairs and flyaways, um, and this is. I didn't put bottom. <laughs> Mascara on. Hold on. Let's, let's see how it looks if we put actual like mascara on the bottom lashes. You know, you know. Let's see what happens. Take that look up a notch. Okay, I put the bottom on. Okay. Everybody, that's it. That's the final look. Let me know how you feel in the comments. I don't want to give this back to Shaz, but I guess I must, considering she spent all this money on it. She probably wants her products. But I really do appreciate her for letting me be the one to actually break into it and actually use it first. I feel bad when I do that for me, to people, but she let me, and I asked her if it was okay first. So anyway, I like it. I hope you guys like it. This is derp approved. Let me know how you feel in the comments. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Um, if you want to see the next video and know when it comes out immediately, hit that little bell icon because that'll uh, that'll alert you. Also, I hope you didn't. I hope you enjoyed my little friends in joining us today. I can't words. I don't know why, but I had fun playing with makeup and seeing all the new Jeffree Star stuff because I was extremely excited about all the purple. However, I don't wear a lot of purple, so I don't know why I was so excited, but I do like purple eyeshadow. I wear a lot, I, or I, I shouldn't say I wear a lot of purple eyeshadow, but I do like purple eyeshadow. I'm trying to not have a horrible shadow, so in case you're wondering why I keep switching back and forth like this, it's because I'm trying to hide my shadow. <laughs> no, my phone keeps getting in the way. You see it? And shadow. Anyway, thanks again for watching. If you did make it this far, considering now I'm ranting, I love you. Have a wonderful day. I don't know what else I was going to say. You're the best. Um, Let me know down in the comments if you guys want to see a cover video. Hey, hey, let me know. Thanks. Derp out.